I live in San Diego because uh, I like to fish, and this is where I grew up doing it. I just feel at home. I love it. My name is Mike Reedy. I'm the chef de cuisine here at Ironside Fish and Oyster. Ironside is super special to me because it was one of the first restaurants to be getting their fish down at the market and bringing it in fresh. It's really beautifully designed. The cocktails are wonderful. Their beer program is awesome. And obviously their food uh, just shines above many others. We're gonna take Dave down to the Tuna Harbor Dockside Market and we're gonna show him around some of the fishermen and uh, give them some beer. I'm sure they'll be happy. How do you know the way fishermen's hardest to do beer? <laughs> I figured you guys would enjoy it. Can we show you guys around a little bit? Check yeah, let's do it. Love to, love to check it out. Most of the fish was caught in the last day or so, right before the market opens. Yeah. You know, give people of San Diego an opportunity to get really fresh up in San Diego. Super rad. And, and rub shoulders with uh, famous chefs over here. So famous. Oh, come on now. You can see how they're super like stiff still. That means they're caught like yesterday. The major factor with the fishermen is, is trust. The guys that I work with, I respect and trust the most. And that just honest feeling kind of translates into the food and into kind of the community feeling that we have here at Ironside. We're gonna meet up with Luke today. He's gonna give us some uni. Uh, his boat's at Aaron B. And I think his dad's gonna be down there too. Probably has some good stories for us. Always does. <laughs> You know, I've been doing this 47 years now. You see, we started sh shipping everything in Japan. 95% uh, went to Japan. They had the uh, bubble economy. So all of a sudden, the market for sea urchins in Japan started drying up. And that's when we started marketing it locally. Anthony Bourdain would, would uh, talk about how he loves the uni and so on. And that's what it took. But until these guys came along and said, no, nah, this is not just a Japanese thing. This is real good stuff. People right. will like it. You know, we can do it in every seafood restaurant, conserve this stuff. Right. And so that started maybe 10, 12 years ago. Right. When the culture started to change, yeah, where people yeah. cared about getting fresh fish right. locally. And, it takes, right. it takes a exotic, you know, this is exotic stuff. Until then, it, the problem is you can't put ketchup on it, you know. Yeah. <laughs> There's an amazing farmer's market right around the corner called the Little Italy Farmer's Market that we're gonna go check out, scoop up some fresh produce, and you know, we'll see what they have. Where are these guys from? These, these guys are also Vice Valley Center. That's where Great. a lot of that, Yeah. a lot of the, our produce is coming from, Great. the good stuff that you like. Oh yeah, it's yeah. awesome, man. It's, it's really like magical in a way. It's just like Ironside is. So, what's up, Noah? How you doing, dude? Good, yeah. I got it. So they grow a lot of the staple stuff like garlic and Awesome, you know, you don't really see too much of that here. This is a Rosa Bianca, so basically the, sometimes the eggplants have seeds and they're bitter. So you make a soup out of these because the seeds like aren't really bitter at all. It's like really sweet. It's like a normal one, you know, normal eggplant. Can I just take all that eggplant off the table? What's inspiring is the farmers and the fishermen and what they do on a daily basis and my job is to not mess up what they do. Just take the really great ingredients that they grow or, or catch and, and just do th simple things to them. One of my favorite bars in San Diego is Craft and & Commerce and uh, we're actually gonna meet up with Kelly and hang out. One of the coolest craft cocktail bars in town, kind of the guys who started up the craft cocktail movement. May we please have Brussels sprouts, Korean barbecue wings, a beef tartare, and a bone marrow. Craft and Commerce recently did a remodel and with that remodel came a speakeasy called False Idol, which is a tiki bar. It's kind of my happy place. It's like my Disneyland. 
thank you so much to Mike Reedy uh, for showing us around, you know, having some Mai Tais after work. I mean, it's all in a day's work. It was, it was fun to see. It's big ships, small ships, ships that sail the sea, but the best ships are friendships, the one like you and me. Salute.